Hey, greetings, Tuberinos. How you doing? Well, I hope. Say, listen, consider this point of view. This entire planet was constructed for our race of people to come and play. Play? As advanced as you obviously are. And you still play? Yes, play, Mr. Sulu. More complex the mind, the greater the need for the simplicity of play. Exactly, Captain. How very perceptive of you. But Obviously, that was a bit from the original Star Trek TV series, and it outlines a principle that I think is very important. It comes up as a topic for me as a result of watching a video from a subscriber the other day, who, uh, by the name of Vindicator Returns, good guy, check him out, there's a link. His video was really very interesting and revealing. A Christian troll was trying to get to him by making fun of the fact that he still plays, that he has... Uh, a collection of toys that he plays with and this uh, troll thought that's very immature very immature and very revealing of atheists of your uh, immaturity and inability to deal with reality etc 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 and as that little video clip points out I think uh, many intelligent people would disagree there's nothing at all with, wrong with the principle of play um, I think it is in fact true. The more complex the mind, the more the need for play. Um, Simple-minded people don't question and don't move beyond those limits. Um, it's really quite sad that some of those people that limit themselves so severely would think that those who don't limit their minds and their attitudes and their ability to go beyond those those borders. They, they think there's something wrong with those people. Sorry, you're just plain wrong. The simplicity of play is good for the complex mind. I tend to agree. So, don't be afraid. Get out there, do wild and wacky things, play with your toys. <laughs>